Hello everyone, I'd like to share with you a few trades posted on Wednesday 29th of March 2023. These trades were shared by MG who's trading Dow Jones Industrial Average in form of CFT using a Forex broker. In one hour macro chart you see uptrend and that's the channel of uptrend. You can see pullback got completed and price broke the level and it's going up. And you can see that by there with 15 minute structural chart. So using one minute trading chart, you identified two area of the pullbacks and enter two positions and manage them and close them with exit strategy number one. And you can see the result here. So thank you MG for sharing your trades with us. The next trades were shared by MH who's trading NASDAQ CFD. As you see here, there was uptrend in higher time frames and with the entry of one minute trading chart he identified a good pullback here and entered here with very tight stop loss and managed the trade and exit here in the middle of the channel using exit strategy number one again when the price reached the resistance and got reversed he entered with setup b here and uh, managed already close here with profit another is uh, past the break even and is also set the target to close with profit on the other side of support area. So thank you MG for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades were shared by Yan or Global Instructor showing this trade. The macro chart is in complex pullback but it's going down. So using a five minute trading chart he identified a good pullback area and used a one minute trading chart to enter here and manage the position to exit on the other side of channel with good profit and risk to reward ratio and also he traded nasdaq futures and you can see the macro chart is in uptrend so using the structural chart which is in uptrend this wave and this wave was taken and you can see better in 10 second trading chart this trading channel uptrend was a long position and this one had several long position that he took and then the result of this long position trade for the day was average profit factor of 3.62 with 81% to 100% win rate from the long side and short side of the trades and uh, his average win to loss ratio was about 0.8 and his largest winning trade was $195 and the largest losing trade was 104 So thank you Yan for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades are those I have taken at the beginning of New York market session and the video was sent to students with explanation yesterday. So I'm gonna replay the video for you. Hello everyone. I'd like to share with you a few trades that I have taken at the beginning of New York market session on Wednesday 29th of March 2023 these trades were taken on Nasdaq and Russell futures as you see from one hour macro the market after testing this level of low uh, previous day low uh, got rejected the price and the buyers came back and it started a very bullish trend and so it passed the previous uh, close also and high and when the market opened during the New York market session, it was already very bullish and just the bullish candle continued. And then it went down and retested again, some level of new point of control around uh, 12,900 that you see here in this area. And so I just traded these candles took long positions here before the uh, 10 o'clock news on pending home sale and uh, you can see it also some short positions and also long positions on Russell so these trades were taken by the uh, setup T and some by setup uh, B and C uh, when there was a rejection of price at the resistance and support levels and we could see the order flow also confirming uh, so these are these signals were copied by copy trader to multiple apex uh, trader fund accounts 
and the result is showing profit factor of 2.23 with 77% average win rate, uh, 76 from the long and 83 from short sides and the average win to loss ratio was about 0.7 the largest winning trade was 280 and largest losing trade was 194 dollars and so hope this trace taken by the pad system with order confirmation for fast scalping of eminis uh, is useful for you and let us know if you have any questions have a wonderful day